What are the plans for the five to 10 year development of the company? Which projects will be prioritized? In particular, what is the plan and time scale for targeting the deeper sulfides? Dennis, go ahead. Um, I mean, well, we've covered a good, good piece of it. I mean, um, plans for the five year development, get the Empire mine into production, uh, get, I think, next priority into Red Star, do the exploration work into Red Star. And again, if there are um, economic deposit, if, if we find an economic deposit, which we're very hopeful, and particularly with regard to the silver in Red Star, look at developing um, an un probably an underground operation at Red Star. Um, and in the process, obviously, get into the horseshoe and Windy Devil part portions of the um, of the extension. We, we you've got to remember that we've got 5.3 kilometers of SCARN uh, along that whole trend. And quite frankly, the exploration of uh, Red Star northwards is, is actually quite a quite a major undertaking in, in its own right. And then, of course, we've got Navarre Creek um, again, which is sitting on, if you like, easily accessible um can be accessed from the surface and drilling that will be next and then i think the uh, we start to consider um depending on what happens with those obviously the underground uh, the underground sulfides uh, and the underground sulfides uh, we would look at along that entire 5.3 kilometer lecture uh, section of, uh, of strike length mm. we've got enormous potential uh, and, and really, we're just planning to get it moving using the cash throw uh, thrown off by the Empire open pit to get us started.